Hello again, it's Helen Howe from Helen Howe Designs and I'm going to show you today how to put together my latest pop-up card. Now, as usual, my cards are very simple to make but um, have a really good effect. Now, in this kit, you will get a card outside and a card inside and I have already glued the two together. If you're better at lining up than me you can do back-to-back -back printing but I never get my printer set quite right and I'm always a, a tiny bit out so I just do the two separately and stick them together. So that's that. You will get two panels that will go into your card and you will get um, four of these little squares I've left one to show you that hold the panels out and, and give you the pop-up effect plus an envelope which I've already made okay so I'll move that out the way and I'll put the panels to the side so I've done the first thing and you know that your inside fold will be um, a, va a valley fold and your outside will be a mountain fold and I find it best to score both singly and fold them and then fit them together so that the actual folding of it's easier. Now your card is going to sit up like that. All right so the first thing we need to do is make these little panels. I've done these ones so I've only left one for me to show you to do because it's boring watching people score I think so we'll just get those lined up good and give them a quick score this card doesn't take very long to make um, now I've scored that as you can see but I find even though we want to do a mountain fold because this is gloss paper I find it's better to fold it in to um, the score line first and then fold it back out. That way you're not stressing the gloss paper out. So you have got your four panels. Two each go on each of the other panels. Now the first panel is going to be this one. And we are going to fix that to this card. So let's get rid of the scoreboard because I don't need that anymore. I'll put it down here. Now then, I am going to attach two of these to, to this. And I've just done a very tiny bit of decoration on this. You can do whatever you please. All right. The other thing I want to say before I forget is you have got a little bit of fussy cutting for this panel, but these antlers, but if you take your time, the result is worth well worth it. Now I used a scalpel to, to cut this. Um, you could use a very, very fine pointed pair of small scissors. Anyway, it's up to you, um, what you what you do. So, I am using my trusty Easy Runner glue tape and I'm going to put some on both sides. One on there and one on there and I want another one. You go I really recommend these I used to use glue all the time um, before purchasing this and I swear by this now so what we need is one at each end okay so I'm going to go for about that spot there that way I know I've got my tabs correct I will line it up with the top and then I know that they're lined up you can choose wherever now the next thing is to fix it to your card but you need your 
your panel to sit on the ground, okay? So this can be just a little tricky getting this to, to be where you want it to be, as it were. That's what I want. Can I get it in there? No, see, I've moved it. That's, that's what I mean. Get it down that way. It on the ground, yes. Um, put this down and stick it there, right. And I find it easier to press your card down that way to make sure that you've got a stick. And there's your first layer. And even I've done it too high. Look at that. So I'm going to have to remove it. off and I'm going to put more um, glue tape onto these because it loses its stick otherwise. See we all make mistakes as you've seen me do many times in my videos. All right let's try again to keep this on the ground. That's got to stay up like that, and that's got to stay on the ground. So that would be like that. And that will be, is it on the ground? Pull it up a bit. There. Pull it down onto the ground. That's it. It. And now we're going to do exactly the same for this one. And it's still up. <laughs> I'm still too high. But that will be all right. We won't worry about that because we can bring this one down a bit lower. said very simple to make but really has quite a lovely effect when done all right i'm going to be good and put this much lower put it down here and make sure i line the two up that's about right put it there Okay, let's see if I can be a bit better successful with this one. Keep you on the ground, yes. And this one, I'm not, I'm not lining up as well as I should. We've got to come into the middle. To about there because you want to even on both sides and that one works and that's it if you get it to stick that is <laughs> don't get caught up dear and there we go that's your little pop-up card it's as simple as that. They don't stick. They should sit out like that. And they do. There we go. And then you just close it down and it fits nicely into your envelope. So if you make it, just pull it down when you open it. I hope you enjoy doing so. Until next time, happy crafting.